The Miss Mississippi Volunteer Pageant crowned its first winner this past weekend. The nonprofit organization based out of Amory is embarking on a different path. Joining me live is the inaugural winner of the pageant, Miss Mississippi Volunteer, Rachel Shoemaker. Congratulations, Rachel, on winning the crown. Thank you so much. Okay, so tell us a little bit about the Miss Mississippi Volunteer uh, pageant because uh, as you know, there are so many pageants out there. How does this pageant differ? So this is a new opportunity for young women in Mississippi. It is the statewide branch of the National Miss Volunteer America pageant. We have five points to our crown and they spell out the word serve and they stand for scholarships, education, responsibility, volunteerism and empowerment. So we are bringing in some of the old aspects of pageantry that we all love, the glamour, the swimsuit competition, but also incorporating some new aspects, really focusing on volunteerism, really focusing on educational scholarships and providing young women a new avenue. Maybe for those women who have not felt comfortable in pageantry before, we're offering them a place in Miss Mississippi Volunteer. Now, uh, Rachel, I have to say, how did it feel uh, that crowning moment when you actually won the competition and you had that crown placed on your head? It was an indescribable feeling. I was so honored to be chosen as the first. That's an opportunity to get to create and mold this organization into its fullest potential that I'm able to see. I was just so happy. I looked into the audience and saw my mom and my village of people who helped me get to this point. Not to mention, I was very blessed to win a $10,000 scholarship in that moment, which will help me fund my future endeavor of law school. So it was very exciting and a feeling that I'm going to try to cling to for this entire year. Now, um, what's very interesting about this particular pageant is that you are now the official partner for the Mississippi Highway Patrol's DRIVE program. Tell us a little bit about that campaign. So long before there was ever a contestant to enter the Miss Mississippi Volunteer Pageant, our executive director, Mr. Steve Stockton of Amory, and our board of directors got with the Mississippi Highway Patrol to start this partnership. Mississippi consistently ranks in the top five for teen driving fatalities. And in 2020 alone, 70 Mississippi teens lost their life to a driving related incident. That's a pretty serious and alarming statistic. And the Highway Patrol can do a lot, but it means something special to have a young woman. Um, I also have a teen counterpart, Mary Kate Nelson, Miss Mississippi Teen Volunteer. We will get to go into schools and talk to children who we've been in their shoes about safe driving habits. And they may be more likely to listen to our message. You know, we've all felt that excitement of having a driver's license or getting a new car for the first time. Mm -hmm. And we often forget that it's actually very dangerous to drive. And so my mission in partnering with the Mississippi Highway Patrol is to try my hardest to reduce that number of fatalities for 2021. If I can save just one family, the grief of losing their child to a driving related incident, it all will have been worth it. Wow, that is really awesome. And it's great that the Mississippi Highway Patrol decided to actually partner with Miss Mississippi uh, Volunteer. Well, Rachel, thank you so much there for joining us this afternoon. Congratulations on your win and congratulations on the year that you're going to have before you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it and looking forward to this year. All right. Thank you so much, Rachel. Thank you.